Hey guys, today I'm reviewing Vita Liberata Phenomenal 2-3 to three Week Tan Mousse in the Dark Shade. I gave this self tanner 1.25 out of 5 stars, so it's one of the worst self tanners I've tried and I feel like the name of this is so deceiving, I'll tell you why in a second. Um, I got this at Sephora and this is 4.22 ounces and it sells for $54. So that's really expensive. Over $50 for a self tanner is like ridiculous. I could get multiple spray tans for that amount um, for a way better color than this one produced. Anyways, that's like $12.80 an ounce. Again, very expensive. Um, this one is a mousse that comes out with a brown guide. Um, so you could definitely see where you're applying it. This does come with a tanning mitt when you buy it so you can um, I would definitely recommend using that to apply it. And um, this is, so they say it has an odor remove technology. Like a lot of Vita Liberata products out there, this one claims to have no scent. I don't know where they're getting that from because you can definitely smell it and it definitely does not smell good. It smells like DHA, sour DHA. So it really doesn't smell good. The smell isn't really overpowering, which is good, but it's definitely there and it got stronger by the next morning. It could smell, still smell the sour DHA smell. So their odor remove technology doesn't work. <laughs> Putting it on is very, it's easy. I mean, you put it on like you would any mousse with a guide, use a tanning mitt, be very careful. The texture holds its texture nicely so it stays foamy, it doesn't melt or anything. That was nice. Um, the drying time, this one actually was really sticky. It dried relatively quickly within like 30 minutes, but then after that I still felt sticky. Um, and I could feel, like when I would go like this with my body parts or go to sleep, they were sticking together. I could even hear them when I pulled them apart. <laughs> so that's bad when that happens. Um, so it definitely didn't dry as much as I'd like it to. It stayed sticky. And this one, when I washed it off, it came, out, it came off on my towels. So it's pretty messy. The color produced is where this one really missed the mark. It is the dark shade, but after I washed it off, it was like one shade darker, maybe. I felt so pale, I didn't feel like I'd even had a self tan on. And this one claims to last two to three weeks. Heck no, there's no way this one lasts that long. Spray tans don't even last that long. Um, I just feel like this title is so misleading because people are buying it thinking, oh, I'll apply it once and then it'll last, my tan will last two to three, day, three, two to three weeks. You're lucky if your tan will even last two days with this one. The instructions say to apply it three days in, or like three times in a row with 24 hours between each application. So basically what they're saying is this a, gra is a gradual tanner. Um, they don't say that on the bottle, but I feel like that's also misleading. And it's not worth the work to get one shade darker each time and gradual tanners don't even last two to three weeks and this one definitely does not last that long. Um, I looked online just to see if I was the only one that didn't have a good experience with this. I definitely wasn't. I read some experiences from extremely pale girls who didn't get any color either. So I don't know what's going on with this. How they can call it a dark tan, I really don't know. It's not dark. I didn't look like I had tanned at all. I was really upset with my color. You guys know I like to be dark. I wasn't even a light shade. Um, so like I said, it lasts like two days maybe, and it comes off on your towel. Just not, it's just not a good experience I had. Men, I don't think you'll like this one. It's pretty, it's actually very expensive. Over $50 for basically a gradual self tanner. I could get weekly spray tans for less money than a $50 self tanner. Um, that's what I want to avoid by buying a self tanner because they're usually more cost effective. They last longer like you can use a bottle for like a month or two. So that's what I want to avoid. I, I just really wasn't happy with this product at all. So I gave it 1.25 out of five stars. And for more information on this self tanner as well as many others, please visit us online at selftanning.com and on Facebook and Twitter.